Hello everyone, thank you for joining me, The Blobber, with our Salem On series. We have just started our war with Ming and Bahamanas. We are going to eat a hell of a lot out of Ming. We're going to d destroy Bahamanas' alliance with Ming so that we can go to war with him after, using uh, Imperialism. Ming we're eating now using... Uh, Overseas expansion. And we'll see what we think about Tibet, but meh. Maybe we'll turn them into a vassal as well. Uh, hopefully by the end of the war we, we should have this client states, so that when we peace out we don't have to worry about being overextended. Because we can just turn everything into client states. Uh, what else? We are working our way around blockades here. Yes, half there without too much thought into it. The Mingan Navy is coming, but they're a little bit behind, so our ships should be a couple of classes better than theirs. Maybe even two? At least one, but maybe even two. Let's... No, they just got 60. Yeah, so we've got 19 and 22 on them, which is pretty significant. I think we should be able to take that. At least as long as Khmer helps. Tell them they're allowed to attach. Now, Bahamanas look like they've given up here, so we will redistribute our wall. like Kim Lang Zan is going to catch them. And then when my heavies arrive, we should get walloped. Yeah. Now where are they running to? Oh yes, let's... Can I just build one Merc to like walk here, jump here, hop on there? It's not a fort or anything, is it? No, it's not. Now we're trying to blitz down uh, Tibet here. Okay, losing money is okay. our conversion going slowly. We're getting there, at least in comparison to how much attention we're paying on the war and how quickly we were speeding by before. Sailor pool. Another couple of thousand. We were just below three and now we're we were at three three just below it and now we're halfway to three four. Oh, I wonder if I could can turn them into protectorates. They think they're too big. Okay, I understand. Now the hope is that Lang Zhang and Khmer here provide a bit of a distraction for Ming while we push out Tibet and Bahamanas. Speed up a little. In fact, we've probably almost got
no sneaky going and knocking down my house while I'm away. Oh, pause. Oh, Hermanus wants to take this engagement again. We don't mind if they do that. We have a severe technological... Well, actually it's not that severe to him. It is super severe to Minglo, technological edge. So we can go interrupt there. We can start coming across here. That finished. Now, how are we doing? A one, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. ships. Let's walk over there and hope that they eject into here when they retreat. Yep, they lost five of their heavies and they're retreating here. So we'll push them... Oh, no, they're retreating to... Not clear. I think they're retreating to this one. I don't know if it was Lee Chair. Like, it's hard to tell. Uh, how are we doing everywhere else? that goes well, we might change the distribution of that. India can go take care of Ming up there while I spread out all over Tibet. Ooh, now we want to do the... we want to try and finish off here all of these fetishists so that we don't have to ever come back and put down rebels here. And then we're going to do my colonies. That's fallen, so we can move up, and up, and up, and up. Looks like he might want to take the fight again. Or he's changing his mind. Oop. Reinforce run away, reinforce then return. Reinforcements should be enough. Yep. Now, it looks like they were stuck here and that they came out and moved there. And that's got a fort on it, so I can't fix that so easily. But I can be annoying. <laughs> what I should do is get one month's repair in at least. succeed at that. A little sad, but oh well. You know what? We'll counter that by saying preemptively build another new stack in case that one dies. Run away. I can't escape. Bye bye. Can be their sole victory. Yep, this wants to move up to there. Whoop whoop, retreat, do you stay there? No, you come back, you're not reinforcing here, you changed my mind. We're just gonna work along 
not up there. I'm gonna work purely from our eastern border. Boom 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 and then down. Now Tibet will probably accept losing their alliances. Doesn't give us a huge piece. As long as it's less than 10 years, it's alright. There we go. So come down, and then we'll redistribute from there. Oop, so that finished. So we will go repair, and then work out what we're going to do next. Meanwhile, this guy can move up to here. Sorry, but you're not allowed to be siege anything, my friend. We'll go help Langzang because they've been they've been suffering quite a battering if we're honest with ourselves. Haven't you, poor Langzang? Where are you? Yeah. bit over the force limit, but not much. Now, we will start moving towards our friends. To make me... Okay, so we go one here, reinforce, come back. It's certainly costing us some manpower. Why did he resign? Okay, that's why. G, group up. One more month of repair, actually two more months of repair there. Blockades go well, blockades go well. Okay, all the fully repaired ones. Turn to blockading that. Yep, you're about to catch me here. Good for you. It's the one of the few battles that you will win. Grab. Oh, we should be able to afford the, um... Big support. I need even more. Because <sighs> I want to get the Inquisitor, who I'm allowed to hire again. But I'm not. Oh well, well, we'll just wait. Uh, in the meantime, we'll hire whoever's level 3. Inflation reduction guy. We've got a little bit of like, inflation we could afford to be rid of. Yeah, of course we lost that. That's not surprising. Can defend it, or the other two can come across here. Actually, do you go there? Ooh, are you going to beat us? Okay. Yes, so we stop, we go nowhere. Actually, we could move here and here. Can't see what we would encounter. 27th of June. Though both leave on the 21st and he arrives on the 30th, so I think that's a safe encounter. 
other than this we move up to take that. This is finished, so you know what, we're going to bring that over. Yep, we're defending here, so pile on. Defending in the jungle. In fact, we might even hire a general. Wooda, speed two. They're trying to reinforce, so we shall do so too. If that is what they wish. They wish to turn this into the all or nothing battle. Now, we can move up, 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 up. Being a just hopelessly out-disciplined in this match. ask who has the most max manpower. Oh, it is me. Good for me. Now, those repairs finished, so we move up and blockade here. Kind of time when you wish you could play two player, one person concentrating on each front. Where's this? For their, uh, it's not doing bad things for their morale really. Half of us can stand on each of those, blocking the border. location, so that's fine. <clears throat> Bahamas isn't making any any engagements yet. Let's re-up with our friends. Stopped upping with so that they don't feel unloved. Let them know that we do love them. there that might be a help too. So we'll tell him to go there and then there. Ah, sneaky. That's why we made that extra stack. In the Diplo. That Diplo tech. Boom. Good. Now I have all the Diplo tech I need. siege down that back for them. I might go help with their rebels. I'm just that generous. Meanwhile, 
whilst we have exhausted our manpower, we will raise the levies. Rival of our rival, Persia again. They would need all those tricks and I can't be bothered at the moment. What else? Create a proper fleet. You know, we will accept that one because when we go up to the, this Diplotech, which we've already just done actually, haven't we? I can re... I can take back all of my little boats and upgrade them. we can consider oh, perfect <clears throat> getting rid of that one and we'll actually wait to oh, to fix these oh, it looks like they're losing anyway because they didn't realize how far ahead of by our well, how much further ahead of uh, them we are with our boat tech so we'll go back here back here Their reinforcements were a bit late. Conversion completes, so we work on other of these fetishists. That all looks good. A lot of reinforcement to do, but that's okay now. Split, I think that's about right. And if we it needs to be in our port, so we move down to one of our ports. That's about to finish, so we'll move across because they'll pop out. We have beaten those rebels for them. We will go help these fight each other, whilst this guy, no, come here, and then help with autonomous rebel support. Actually no, we'll turn off rebel support and do it ourselves. Uh, they've got Ming reactionaries, which I don't mind them having there, because they can't do anything about them. We defeated that. We will try and get one month's equipment. Uh, we can move down there now. So we here. Once that gets a repair in, we'll move across to here. These have finally arrived, so we can pop, spend down to upgrade them. Take a little bit of time for them to finish reinforcing, but it's not like we've got low sailors. We could probably build a, like half a billion ships, something of that many. Yeah, I'm not exaggerating at all, but it certainly is many. To defeat these, come and help. Yep, take that one. Ming looks like they're trying to pivot up and across, but they can't because access to Korea is in the war. I hate you. Oh well, let them try and move up and across. We helped them with this siege. That finished repairing, so we move up and across. Where is he moving to? There, so we intercept. Now, what about here? Our boats have repaired. How far can I reach? Fair way, so you know what? Let's move up. Not like Korea. Even Korea plus Ming no, don't have enough boats to interfere with my heavies there. This is here in case we need to reinforce there. 
happening here? He looks like he's moving around, that's alright. See how we go. Yep, he cancelled his running that way, so we move down. Cross. Well, I caught some of them. Where's he? Ooh. Caught some of them. Now we want to go find out where he was trying to go. We could take an engagement, but I kind of need to wait and reinforce a bit. It would be nice if Delhi was... Yeah, Delhi is helping down here. I'm exaggerating. Take that one back for him. Move these guys down here in case we need to reinforce there. He's being a cheating bastard. Uh, trying to move that way. heavies. Brilliant. Pause. Need to do a little bit of repairing. Trying to move through there, which I kind of don't. Where he tries to go. We see him down here, so I move up. Then we wait until we get some actual garrison. Then we move up. Meanwhile, Ming are probably bankrupting themselves with mercenaries. Oh, they're going to go try and take Delhi. Let's get ready to reinforce. This one's not finished. Bengal, uh, Delhi can be trusted to finish that one. They may actually win here, which would be slightly 
slightly problematic. Sieging that. Can we pivot across yet? Are they willing to give up their alliance with Ming? That's all I want. Thank you. We'll come get you later. Pivot across to Ming. Watch this. Go get that one back. side. Oh, they have formed Hindustan. Good for them. Exhaustion Wang Zong, isn't it? I am sorry. I mean, whilst has our conversion finished? No, nope, halfway there. What about our colonies? Ooh, we have actually got some colonies about to finish, and one has finished properly. So we recall that one, send one here, send one here. This one. One, two, three, four, five. That should finish Australia. of coast. But it is what I want, Ming. So it's what we will continue to fight for. Meanwhile, his war exhaustion should be going up and up and up. He's still got his western influences. National defense, my ass. Stupid cheating AI with their cheating modifiers. But oh, I've gotten too much fun, had too much fun and watched this war has gotten us over time for the episode. So thank you for joining me, The Blobber, with our Salem On series. I hope you've enjoyed watching and will join us again soon. Bye bye. <laughs>